This is Trio. Scanners are showing a manufactured object ahead. We're coming up on it now. It has some kind of logo on it. Corfu. Readings indicate low-level power source. Jen, can you identify it? Satellite 5AX. An unmanned surveillance satellite commonly used by Earth outstations as an extraplanetary monitor. A satellite? Orbiting what? Well, according to our navigational banks, there's a planet with an oxygen-based atmosphere in this solar system. That must be Corfu. Affirmative. At the time of Deepwater's launch, the planet, Corfu, was uninhabited. This satellite is conducting a systems probe of Deepwater. It may have a communications relay. All right, let's see. Find uh, the frequency it transmits on and open a channel. This is the deep water. Do you read? Repeat. This is the deep water. Please respond. A communication is coming in from the planet's surface. On screen. Deep water? Are you kidding me? This is really deep water? Please, identify yourself. I'm, uh... Carl Coleman, manager of the uh, Corfu Resort and Spa. Resort? Uh, part of the Galactic Holidays chain. Deep water. I am honored. Your mission is historic. Say, is Corfu the first Earth colony your ship has contacted? <laughs> we are returning to Earth on an elliptical voyage from deep space. It is our mission to... Yes, yes, yes. I, I know your mission. <laughs> it's famous. <laughs> Rebuild the human population. Your craft was launched during the Pandora epidemic. But you have had other contact. You have heard, haven't you? Heard what? The uh, Pandora virus was eradicated right after your ship was launched. I'm afraid your mission is redundant. Through the vastness of space, a single ship carrying a crew of six speeds toward Earth. This is the story of their mission, to restore human life to a home they have never known. And television has you didn't know no we didn't yes life on earth is thriving as you'll find out when you get there but for now welcome to corfu let me invite you as my guests down to the resort corfu is beautiful you won't believe our twin moons excuse me mr coleman i'm anxious to know exactly how you contain the pandora virus Oh, I, uh, I can only really give a layman's take on it. I'll tell you what, though. You're more than welcome to come down and use our library. Although, I, I gotta tell you, we are a resort, so don't expect a research facility. Don't expect a research facility. The complexity of the treatment doesn't justify such expenditure. The whole crew should come down. Real fresh air, sunshine, kick back by the pool. Well, we have your coordinates. Mr. Coleman will confer and get back to you. Please do. Thank you, Deepwater. Is it possible that humanity wasn't destroyed? The probability would seem low. The Deepwater data banks remained current until our vessel fell outside communications reception. But it's not out of the realm of possibility. It is possible. All right. We'd better check it out. Yeah. 
Why is it that only Rev and Yuna get to go to the surface? Man, I'm getting space fever cooped up in here. If our mission is over, let's celebrate. What do we have to go on that our mission is over? Huh? His word? Brain, relax. Relax? Listen, our sensors aren't picking up any indications of weaponry. That could mean they're deploying some kind of cloaking device. Or it could mean that the resort is exactly what Coleman said it is, a resort. Come on, Bren. If it looks like a party and acts like a party, it might just be a party. Here, try this. It's very relaxing. These are a couple years out of date. We're too far out for live feed, but uh, these are the most recent in our library. Ah. There it is. Good old Earth. Very much alive. A Pandora treatment was unveiled just months after your vessel left communication radius. All our programming, all our implants, every impulse has been towards Rebuilding a devastated planet. I'm sorry. I thought this would be good news. No, no, don't be sorry. It is. It is. It's great news. I just don't know. Well. <laughs> I am so glad to see that my staff was able to uh, outfit you in something more appropriate for Corfu. Very appropriate. I don't know what triggered it. Typically, Prex and Key's office sense memory. Anything about the resort, the planet, anything that might be relevant to the Prex? No, I, I don't think so. I, I mean, I, I don't know. Brent, look. What is it? A bulletin from Lowell about the treatment for the Pandora virus. He can't do this. Not when we're so close to a cure. That was another one. What was it? It was something about the cure. That there was something wrong with, with the treatment. It's amazing to think that Earth survived. Yes. And now you get to enjoy all this. Uh. Thank you very much, Kayla. Would you hold this while I pour some drinks? I'm sure it's a life-changing revelation for you. I've done some stiff about faces myself. I was a businessman. <laughs> Doing the corporate nine to five when the virus was eradicated in me. I kicked the rat race, got away from it all, created my uh, own little utopia. What is this? Oh, it's a uh, radion scepter. I collect them. How unique. Mr. Coleman, you were cured of the virus? No, man. How is it that you suffered a disease that was eradicated over four centuries ago? Oh, you wouldn't know this, of course. The virus was not eradicated, per se. It was controlled, kept in remission by a treatment of regular DNA irradiation. A total cellular rejuvenation. A not unhappy side effect of cell regeneration is it prolongs life, apparently indefinitely. I'm 438 years old. Dallas, Texas. Nobody
I'm reading an increased amount of electrical neural activity. Greta, are you sure you didn't see anything or sense anything that could have triggered this specific emotional response? Lowell Pharmaceuticals will not submit to emotional blackmail. As president of Lowell Pharmaceuticals, I'm forced to terminate the DNA irradiation research. Mr. Lowell, you can't do this. The promise is slim. The complexity of the treatment doesn't justify the expenditure. Let's cut to the chase, Lowell. There's been a rumor that a cure has been found at one of our sister labs. All right, available only to the wealthy and powerful. I'm surprised at you, Ms. Marcus. That's an urban myth. How do you possibly justify corporate cost saving when lives hang in the balance? This is murder. It's genocide. Lowell Pharmaceuticals will not submit to emotional blackmail. The lab is closed. That voice. It's his voice. Coleman has Lowell's voice. We were headed for anarchy in the final days of the plague. There was rioting, and billions suffered and died needlessly. Well, how would Coleman have escaped to Corfu? With the cure, he could name any price. For what it's worth, I've read about a rumored treatment. Yeah, but that was centuries ago. I agree. Coleman is suspicious. But this doesn't make any sense, Gret. I mean, how? Look, I don't know how. I don't know how it is. I just know. You know, that suffering was unimaginable, and he is responsible for it. Coleman and Lowell are the same man. Look, my genetic source died. She watched her friends, her co-workers, and her loved ones. They all died, and he let it happen. Coleman is the most callous criminal in the history of humankind. Deep water, come in, please. Reb, any new developments? A few. Coleman has technology that not only eradicates the Pandora virus, but it prolongs life as well. He can actually remember the plague days on Earth. The man is over 400 years old. Reb, back in the plague days, there was a man. His name was Edmund Lowell. He was president of a pharmaceutical empire. Reb, are you there? Jen, what's going on? Deepwater has been targeted by a tractor beam. Orbit is deteriorating. Trace it. Coleman's outpost. Deepwater, this is Reb. Come in, please. Corfu is experiencing one of our periodic bouts of solar flaring, intensified by the gravitational pull of our twin moons. Off-planet communications may be disrupted. We regret any inconvenience. Convenient inconvenience? No kidding. And why is it that no one other than Coleman talks to us? That server earlier, she didn't even look at me. I don't know. But I want to find out Coleman's intentions. I think it's time we tried to leave. Jen, earth powered weapons. Negative. All auxiliary power is needed to sustain orbit. Mm -hmm. I knew his power source was cloaked. Now we're stuck here. I'm taking beta shuttle to the surface. No, you're not. Not without me. It's too dangerous. Rem, you can't leave the ship. If he increases power on the tractor beam, our orbit will decay and we will crash to the surface. Look, I know what I saw in my prex, and I have to face Coleman. Do a low-level recon first. Right. Could you tell Mr. Coleman we've had to return to our ship? Hey, you two. <laughs> Sorry about the communications foul up. Just one of the many charms of Corfu. We've had a problem aboard the deep water. We're returning by shuttle. Oh, well, I'm sorry, that isn't possible. Well, these solar flares cause uh, major atmospheric disturbances. We've had to put up our shields. It's far too dangerous. Oh, I've flown in rough weather before. I just can't permit it. We're not asking your permission, sir. We're returning to our ship. You're not going anywhere. 
There are no solar flares, are there? Why don't you have a drink and relax? It's all a scam. Vid clips, everything. Earth wasn't spared. A harmless masquerade. You'll be quite content here. Everyone loves Corfu. Really. And these people? Uh, labor drones. The only clones I can replicate thanks to an inferior grade of gene bank. A little trick played on me by my suppliers. Why did you tell us Earth was spared? I knew that would get you down here. Hope springs eternal, right? Now, come with me. Ah! Ah! Stand away from the console. Please. If we don't report back, sooner or later our crew will come looking for us. I'm counting on it. So what? Are you going to kill us all? I don't want to have to. Funny the way you show it. I've been 400 years with no company other than a computer-generated hologram or a worker drone. I'm sure it was lonely. But somehow I get the feeling that once you get your hands on our gene bank, you'll get tired of us and grow new friends. Unless you want the shock of your life, Mr. Coleman, I suggest you pass that weapon to Yuna. Deactivate your tractor beam and drop your shields now! Oh, look, another guest. Welcome to Corfu. This is it, Lowell. Gret, lower your weapon. We've got him. No. Years of cellular tinkering may have changed your face. But you are still the same monster who allowed billions to die for your own gain. I don't know what you're talking about. I know your voice, Lowell. You're a murderer. Billions died because of you. No. You're mistaken. Brent, lower the weapon. Young lady, I don't know who you think I am. You may not have his fingerprints, his cell structure, or his DNA. But you, you are still him. Oh, miss, there's no judge here. No tribunal, no court of law. The only justice there is, is right there in your hand. So if you're so sure, 
then for God's sake, shoot. Brett, don't. Let's go. say something reassuring like he'll live forever imprisoned with his conscience and his fear but i don't think he gets it Reb. i don't think he's capable of feeling guilt i'm afraid you may be right well whoever he is no one else should be tricked onto the surface of that planet well there's one way to make sure of that destroy the satellite Tonight on Trio, Linehan, followed by...